you think it's gonna take long? No, he should be finished soon. God, I'm bored. I hate having nothing to do. Let's get the formalities out of the way so I can get back to where you work. I gotta see Captain Perry. Orders are orders. Gee, I hate internal politics bullshit. I could go for a little bit time right about now.
You said the methodology indicated another victim of the origami fall. Can you be more specific? An origami figure was found in the victim's hand, and an orchid was placed on his chest. His face was covered with mud, but there were no visible traces of violence to the body. Go ahead. Uh, the Zodiac killer was never identified. Perhaps the origami killer was never found either. I don't think there's much chance of that. For the moment, the killer may think he's invulnerable, but in the end, he'll make a mistake and we'll be there to arrest him. Yes? Did the killer leave any written evidence? Perhaps a ransom note explaining his actions? Or anything like that? No. He has not made contact in any way, and we have only the murders to help us understand his motives. Yes? That's absurd. The police make no distinctions between victims based on their social class. It is true that the origami killer seems to choose his victims from the more impoverished parts of town. The higher crime rate in these areas makes the investigation more difficult. Time for a couple more. Yes. There are rumors that the FBI has sent a profiler to help with the investigation. Is that true? You seem to be well informed. Yes, we asked the FBI to send us a profiler to help us with this investigation. We were planning to announce this in the next few days, but it seems that won't be necessary. According to certain sources, the town hall has been applying pressure to avoid any mention of serial killers in order not to have an adverse effect on the mayor's election campaign. Do you have anything to say about that? Pure speculation. At no time has the mayor been involved in this investigation except to support the efforts of the police force, of course. Thank you for your cooperation. One question, please, sir. One last question. Captain Perry, one more question, please. I'll have a look around the station. Stretch my legs for a bit. Strange character, Captain Bell. Seems to be more interested in meeting the press than investigating the crime. I saw Blake when I arrived. Maybe I should go talk to him. Could you get Perry's assistant to show me my office? I can't wait to get to work. I'm ready to start. Maybe we should kick off by talking about the case? I have some work to finish here. Talk about that later, if you don't mind. Okay. Uh, no problem. Just let me know when you're available. I'm really starting to dislike that guy. Better watch my back from now on. Nice watch. Oh, it's the present we offer to our new lieutenant. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time, and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like. We're still a few dollars short. Congratulate Larry on my behalf. I'll be sure to do that, sir. Captain.
Jim Perry said you could show me to my office? Yes, of course. Thank you. Follow me. place to work, and it certainly looks like I got it. No time to lose. Gotta get down to work. First, analyze the case file. signs of violence. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. No one notices anything. Bodies are found three to five days later. Drowned. disappeared in the fall. 